Hi everyone, this is Nagalakshmi from the Department of Information and Technology and I'm currently pursuing my degree in Velamal College of Engineering and Technology. According to the survey, only 1% of water is fit to use among the 71% of water that is present on the planet Earth. The rest of the 70% of water is being polluted by organic waste, inorganic waste, plastics and chemicals. And mainly, it is estimated approximately that the 70% of India's surface water is unfit for the consumption. The report further mentions that the India is at the 120th position amongst the 122 countries in the Water Quality Index. Every minute, 17 tons of plastic waste are dumped in the ocean and the total of 10 to 12 million tons of plastic waste are present in the ocean every year. The Blue Revolution is the unique solution to defend the ocean against plastic pollution and provide comprehensive answer through prevention and by correcting action. Like Montre, a sea creature that feeds on uh, filtering the sea water, our Blue Revolution will do the same. It will swallow a plastic waste as small as 10 mm, which is then transferred into an energy. Considering a large ship which can contain maximum 3 tons of plastic waste. And the troll's trap will be present in that ship. Per hour, the 3 troll's trap will be collecting the plastic at the depth of 1 meter, but mainly in coastal waters. In that big ship, we will have mobiles, two multi service mobiles, which can collect waste from shallow and narrow areas like rivers and ponds, etc. Versatilely, they collect macro waste, micro waste and hydrocarbons in rough coastal areas and rivers with a strong current. Each mobile can collect and sort up to 10 cubic meters of waste. The waste management plant located at the headquarters, the waste have to be transformed. The waste is first sorted according to its nature, like glass, metal, plastic, or some other metals. Metals, glasses, and aluminiums are sorted and brought back to the land for recycling through the local waste management system. But the plastic waste are transferred to the shredder, and it is shredded and transformed into into pellets before being sent to. Waste Energy Conservation Unit The real masterpiece of the Blue Revolution is onboard plant that is present inside the ship which converts waste into energy. It melts the plastic at high temperature through paralysis and transforms them into a synthetic gas. The synthetic gas then passes through a turbine which produces the electricity. That electricity in turn will power the whole ship and ship equipments like onboard plants, cockpits and etc. During the conversion process, heat emission and the water gases are recovered, supporting the Mondes principle for an eco-friendly solution. This big ship is capable of collecting 5 to 10 thousand metric tons per year. Our ship is powered by renewable resources which is equipped with hybrid propulsion and automatic rings. Combining the high technology and eco-consciousness, this idea will travel through the world's oceans and rivers and river mouths where the floating plastic is being concentrated because it is urgent to take actions now. Now we have come to a conclusion and now I would like to thank the Imagican Academy for giving me this wonderful opportunity to pitch my idea.